as a feminine woman it is important that you don't chase but you attract the things that you want and not chasing doesn't mean that you're not going to do your part you're not going to put in the work yes you would actually put in the work as well but you're not chasing having the right mindset you're knowing that definitely if this is for me i'm putting as much work as i can then definitely it's gonna come through for me i don't have to chase it i don't have to you know work so hard and work myself off because i am also supposed to enjoy life even while i'm going through a season even while i'm waiting for something even while i'm going through trials and tribulations i still also have to enjoy life as well and be the soft girl that i am so <music> Hi guys welcome back to my channel if it's your first time here hi i'm Majila Chi. i make videos on personal development beauty lifestyle fashion i'm hoping you love the vibe and subscribe i have a personal goal to build my community and get at least a thousand subscribers before the end of this month it will definitely mean a lot to me if you subscribe to my channel it's been a while i did a sit down video your your girl has been going through a lot um so i was talking to my friend the other day and i discovered that we are are going through a growing season and it's something that is so personal and so dear to my heart and i feel like i need to talk about this on my channel because who knows maybe someone out there is also going through it and this video could help because i myself look forward to watching videos like this that serves like a motivation and i really want to connect with my audience better and get a little personal not too personal but at least talk about things like this because i do a lot of personal development content on my channel mindset shifts and all of that and with doing all the work sometimes we get through we get into a phase where we get into a growing season that comes with a lot of growing pains and a lot of challenges that we have to navigate through and sometimes it can get a little bit overwhelming did i say a little bit overwhelming guys your girl is overwhelmed but i'm fine i'm all right i'm going to be talking about things that are going to help you navigate through a challenging season a waiting season or when you're going through a growing pain or a growing season just like i am right now because you you all your girl has been going through a lot i feel like i've been going through a growing season in my life and one thing that is nice and fine about going through a growing season is that at the end of the day you definitely come out better than you went you went through that season of yours so it is kind of necessary because just like they say gold goes through fire and comes out as gold sometimes we go through a season in our life a season that is full of trials tribulations storms and you can feel like it's raining all the time you're going through a lot of challenges from one challenge to the other and it can get a little bit overwhelming and sometimes you can feel like you're all alone so the aim of this video is to tell you that you are not alone if you're going through a season like that and to also let you know some things that might help you navigate through the season better and some things that are helping me why i'm in this season because i feel like for a year or so now i've been going through a growing season and it's been quite overwhelming but it's been quite interesting as well and one thing that has helped me is the fact that i have the mindset and i know that it is a season which takes me to my first tip which is the fact that you have to have the right mindset during this season you have to understand that it is a necessary season of your life and that at the end of the day it's all coming together at the end of the day it only gets better from here at the end of the day everything will eventually work out so it is important that you have the right mindset that you understand that yes everything is going to work out for me eventually at the end of the day it is just a season it's just a waiting season it's just a growing season because i really want to evolve as a person i really want to get better in my career with my career with my finances just as an individual I want to be that woman that I've envisioned myself to be. I want to be that person that is confident, that person who has that shit together, that person who does well for herself individually and who also does well for herself in a relationship, who is ready to take the next step and 
be that next person that she wants to be because growth comes with a lot of responsibilities and when responsibilities come up you have to have evolved you have to be that person that is able to take up these new responsibilities that are going to come into your life so you have to understand that yes this is a thing this is something that actually happens to people and i'm not alone and it is really wonderful that it's happening to me that means i am evolving that means i'm closer to my goals that means you know life is definitely going to get better for me and everything is going to work out even better than i have envisioned it to be it's important that we have this mindset so that we would not be living in anxiety so that we will not be living in fear so that we will not be trembling so that we're not going to go through this season feeling alone feeling like you're done feeling like the whole world is against you feeling sad and depressed and all of that so the right mindset is really very important your mindset is so important your mindset can take you out of a stormy season your mindset can get you through anything that's why mindset is the number one thing in this video is the number one thing you need to have the right mindset while you're going through this waiting season while you're going through trials while you're going through tribulation while you're going through uh, your, your growing season and you know going through your growing pains as well the next thing i'll also like you to do in this season is that you have to be able to let things flow and i'm talking to myself as well because i'm that kind of person that when i feel like things are not really working out the way i want them to do or i'm not really evolving or things are you know going slow i tend to be impatient and i like to walk 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 and you know i'm either i'm editing a video i'm doing something i'm being useful i'm replying a, an email i'm just really putting in a lot of work to be certain that things actually speed up or things work out as i want them to right now i'm trying to just take things slow and actually let things flow because i really want to be able to enjoy life and still remain the soft girl that i am and be able to let things flow and by this i don't mean that you should get lazy or i should get lazy and just be in la la land or be delusional and believe that yes i want things to work out and they're definitely going to work out for me whether i put in the work or not no it is important that i actually put in the work and be able to meet god halfway and do my part and do what i'm supposed to do but i'm not gonna walk myself off or walk so hard till the wheels fall off i'm gonna do put the work put the effort put in work and also still be able to enjoy life still be able to have fun still be able to pour into myself as well because maybe you're going through a storm or you're going through a raining season you don't just head out and just be out everywhere while it's raining why it's raining you could take out your umbrella you could chill at home you could sip a hot cup of coffee or a hot cup of tea you could you know do your self-care or do things that will pour into yourself pick a book and read those are the things that you do during this season you try to pour back into yourself you try to take care of yourself better and relax and do what you're supposed to do and leave the rest and just let things flow it's important that we do this as well so we can come out strong instead of feeling depressed feeling overworked because sometimes you can put in all the work Work, baby girl you can do everything that you think is gonna help you achieve your dreams and you know it's not really sometimes it's not really how much you work how hard you work you just have to be smart as well and in as much as we are chasing our goals we are chasing our dreams we want things to work out in our finances in our career in our relationships and all of that as a feminine woman it is important that you don't chase or you attract the things that you want and not chasing doesn't mean that you're not going to do your part you're not going to put in the work yes you would actually put in the work as well but you're not chasing you're you're having the right mindset you're knowing that definitely if this is for me i'm putting as much work as i can then definitely it's gonna come through for me i don't have to chase it i don't have to you know work so hard and work myself off because i am also supposed to enjoy life even while i'm going through a season even while i'm waiting for something even while i'm going through trials and tribulations i still also have to enjoy life as well and be the soft girl 
that I am. So it is important that we learn to let things flow as well so that things can ev eventually work out as we want them to. The next thing I would like to talk about as well that has helped me during this season is self-isolation. When you're going through this season, it's important sometimes that you take a step back and reflect and be with yourself and find out what you actually want because right now it feels like everything that you want is being tested. It's being tested like, do you really want this career path? Do you really want to take up this next stage of your life? Do you really want this finances? Do you really want to be this woman? that you want to be you have to do all this while you step back and you're self-isolating and you're talking to yourself and and pour into yourself and get to know yourself a little bit more and you know have the right mindset and also build a relationship with god as well because during this season you need to have a relationship with god because it's gonna help you walk through a lot of all these things and you have a more understanding of yourself and your relationship with god and how things are supposed to evolve for you so self-isolating is something that really does help sometimes you have to limit the distractions you don't need all of that because this is a very important season of your life this is a very important point of your life you don't need no distractions because how you treat this season is going to determine how the next season of your life is going to turn out just imagine you a farmer that you plant a seed and you just neglect it you don't come back to it you don't come back to water it you don't take care of it at the end of the day you might come back and your seed is dead and gone but if you nurture it you take care of it at the end of the day when it actually springs forth is going to spring forth to be huge and cool and nice and be what you actually want so it's important sometimes that you take time away and self-isolate and pour into yourself as well so if you're someone that's watching this and you feel like you're going through a season i want to tell you that you are not alone it is important that you go through this to become the best version of yourself to become that woman that you envisioned yourself to be to be who you want to be and to even exceed your own expectations sometimes it is necessary that we go through this season and if you ask people or you listen to people and you will discover that most times before any big major breaks in their life they go through a season a season of waiting a season of growth that involves a lot of growing pains and a season of trials and at the end of the day it eventually works out for the best so it is important that you have the right mindset during this season know that it is a season that is good that would bring forth the woman that you want to be know that you are not alone know that it is a necessary season know that at the end of the day you're going to be victorious have fun even while you are in this season go out um maybe alone or maybe with a couple of people that you feel like are really dear to you you have to be very conscious of this season and be conscious of who you let into your circle as well in this season this season is for you this season is for you to grow is for you to understand life better is for you to understand yourself better is for you to grow into that person because i really want to be that woman that i want to be the dream woman that i have in my head a woman who has evolved so much that even people could notice that yes this woman has changed i look at myself already and i know that i am different from who i was several years ago and already have in my mind what this woman is going to be several years from now so i really wanted to document this to be able to look back at it and realize how much i had i have evolved as a person and how much i knew that this was just a season in my life that was going to get me into this wonderful woman this dream woman that i have in my head so self-isolation sometimes is actually also very necessary build a strong relationship with god as well because this will help you during this season and have the right mindset and definitely i know that you're going to evolve into the person that you want to be you're going to grow into what you want to be as well and i also want to say that this is a safe space as well 
all i'd like to hear from you are you going through something have you gone through something are you familiar with this season let us know in the comment section i really want to hear from you guys and if you also have something you want me to talk about please let me know in the comment section as well and i will definitely see you guys in my next video bye guys